Thank you, Senator Tuberville. Mr. S President. Senator from Indiana. You know, every year I travel, visit every county in the state of Indiana, 92 of them. And you know, I can't ever recall anyone saying that they want the IRS to poke into their business more on a day-to-day -day basis. In fact, they bemoaned the fact that many years ago the IRS was actually sifting through stuff to determine who was conservative or not before they might grant status to your entity. We've gotten to a point, and I think Senator Tuberville and Scott have eloquently laid out the details. I want to take a little different approach. I've been here a little less than three years, and this kind of entrepreneurialism through government, growing the federal government, having an agency like the IRS that can't do its job well with the money that we do give to it, is just another example of trying to pile on one bad thing after another. It'd be different if we weren't doing it, borrowing 23% of the money we spend every year. Imagine that in your own household, in a state or local government. A business, you'd be laughed out of the banker's office if you did that and then wanted a loan to cover it and then do it the next 10 years. It doesn't work anywhere else. This is an example that I think, along with maybe the vaccine mandate where you're now forcing small businesses to do something when they finally got a rhythm and businesses have protected their employees and their customers as well as anybody out there in that journey. You've got that nonsense uh, going to be unfurled here soon, but it is an example of where at some point enough needs to be enough. The IRS has had a poor record of doing things to boot. Uh, earlier, ProPublica, ProPublica released illegally obtained uh, tax records of many Americans. Uh, we had the incident of uh, issues with conservative businesses being discriminated against getting proper uh, status set up. I introduced the Protect Taxpayer Privacy Act in June for that because the IRS is already doing things that they shouldn't be doing. This would be a perfect companion to what Senator Tuberville is putting out here. To wrap it up, we got to be careful. When we send people here, and if you were knocking it out of the park, delivering results, not borrowing money to do the things we try to do anyway, and then you tee up something like this. This is going to do nothing more than unleash more of an agency that doesn't do well at its job anyway, and it's truly an example of government gone wild. And I thank Senator Tuberville for bringing this to a focal point, and I yield back to you.